everybody. My name is Karim Nagy, and this first instrument I played is a tambourine. But in the Arab world where we speak the Arabic language, this is actually called rek, rek. And this is different than a lot of the tambourines that maybe we see here in America or the West where people shake it and hit their hips and get their motor running and head out on the highway. This is actually the Arabic instrument. The rik in Arabic culture, it's like a classical music instrument. It's an instrument that you play with your fingers and that you can get a lot of different sounds with. So I'm actually originally from Egypt, an immigrant to the United States, and this is a very popular instrument in Egypt. So I'm holding it with my two hands like this. My thumbs are behind it. My fingers are in the front of it. And then I can hit all the different areas of the rick with my fingers. So you may hear me go like this. You may hear me go like this. You may hear me hit the cymbals. Those are my fingers on top of the cymbals. And then also shaking as well. And so if I were to play some traditional Arabic music, well, it would depend on how nerdy I want to be. Well, I want to be nerdy because you're so far such a good audience. I'm going to play these rhythms that used to be played when the Arabs were occupying Spain uh, in this period that we call uh, Andalusia, the Andalusian times. So that's like 890 to 1492, where great civilizations like Cordoba, you know, developed. And we would have these very interesting rhythms back then. So I'm going to play rhythms where I count to 13. I'm going to count to 13. I'm going to play this rek, and I hit the sounds, dum, the low sound, and tek, and then all the ornamentation. But I count to 13. I'll play one rhythm where I'm playing 13 over 8, so it's a little bit quick. And then another rhythm, which is 13 over 4, where it's about twice as long. And see if you can count along with me. But you know what? Don't ruin the experience by counting, right? Don't ruin the experience by counting. Listen and see if uh, this pattern gives you any special feelings, OK?
Thank you very much, everyone.